Now, your local weather with the KX Storm Team. 18 after the hour on this Monday morning. Welcome back to Good Day Dakota. And welcome to, boy, it feels like August kind of, doesn't I know. it, Amber? It feels like the dog days of summer yeah. when I give you 80s and 90s for daytime highs. And, uh, you know, this weekend was really nice. Yes. We had a lot of 70s. We had some 80s yesterday. Mm -hmm. uh, and, of course, we had a little bit of a smoke issue for some folks, right. too, which made actually for a beautiful sunset and sunrise. Mm -hmm. Take a look at this picture uh, sent in to us from Lake Metagoshi. Uh, the sun, I believe this was a sunset. Uh, and, again, thank you, Sally, for this picture. Uh, we had a little bit of a haze in the uh, sky over the weekend. We still have a little bit of a haze, but not nearly as bad as towards the end of last week. So it looks like things are starting to improve, but you've got a lot of sunshine nonetheless. That's going to help really heat things up today. What's also going to help heat things up is how the upper atmosphere is set up as well. So here's where we're at right now. You can see here this jet stream and the strongest part of the jet stream notice will stay above us all week. We're going to be on the southern side of that jet stream, which means hot temperatures. And so we're looking at 80s throughout much of the week this week. But notice this trough that begins to develop towards the end of the work week. Well, that's going to move into the upper plains through the weekend. And, and typically this is what carries the chances for some rain and storms. That's where we're going to start seeing our accumulating rain. And it's going to raise some cooler temperatures as well. Right now, 56 in Bismarck, 64 in Minot, uh, 58 in Williston and 57 in Dickinson. Light winds from the south here, 5 to 10. Maybe get a little gusty this afternoon, but uh, nothing at all too strong out there. 80s and 90s today. It is going to be hot. We are talking around 90 for many in the north and the uh, mid to upper 80s in the south. You add that with dew points in the 60s and it'll be a little sticky this afternoon. If you are a runner outside, uh, especially in the afternoon, you're probably going to be doing a little more sweating. Maybe at uh, practice, if you're outdoors, any kind of sports, uh, maybe carry extra water. A warm front moves through this afternoon. Now this is going to bring a chance for some showers and thunderstorms, isolated thunderstorms and maybe a shower or two for the north. But the ones we'll be watching for any severe potential will be in the south. Uh, this is going to be late afternoon, four or five o'clock and then move through this evening. You can see here a uh, large hail damaging wind. It actually pushes through rather quickly overnight. You can see that uh, around midnight. It's not going to last long, but we could see again large hail damaging wind, incredibly low tornado risk. I never say zero. We never say zero here uh, with the storm team. You're not going to typically hear somebody say you never have that risk, but right now the, the, the risk is incredibly low. I'm not concerned with that. Uh, breezy tomorrow with sunshine and highs back into the 80s. You can see here those widespread 80s, uh, slightly above average because average is in the 70s. And so you can see the Dickinson three day forecast. We are back into the 80s and we're going to stay there. In fact, uh, we're going to stay there for the remainder of the work week. 80s today, tomorrow and into Wednesday. Breezy for these days as well in the west. Uh, Williston, the average high 73. We're going to be 90 today, mid 80s tomorrow and upper 80s on Wednesday. As we head through the next seven days, things will change a bit. You know, I told you about that trough for the weekend. That's going to bring us chances for some showers and thunderstorms. It will also bring us cooler temperatures as well. This is the Minot seven day. You can see the 70s for the weekend. Some areas only in the 60s this weekend as well. Here's Saturday and Sunday, of course, just in time for the weekend. A lot of folks like to get out on the lake and they're like, wait a minute, hang on. Right. Where, where's the sunshine in 80s? But uh, we've got plenty of summer for that as well. Yes, we do. Right. Maybe not the most perfectly timed cool down, uh, no. but who cares? You know, Mother Nature can't control that, or we can't control Mother Nature, I suppose. No, but right? there are people throwing things at their TV right now. <laughs> Who cares, right? Who cares, I said, yeah. yeah. Go ahead and throw it right at, right here, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but don't break your TV, please. Uh, keep it with us on Good Day Dakota. Still ahead.